dog in our community. If anybody's so naive to think that we don't have drugs here, you're wrong. It's in our schools, it's all through our community. I think we as a community are making drugs. We're tired of it. We want our kids to have a safe place to grow up without drugs being around. So uh, we appreciate you for your support for today's activities, all the fundraisers, and everything else that we've done. We are very pleased to announce that Rook is now a member of the Houston Police Department. He's paid for. And I want to introduce I want to introduce the owner of Val, uh, Valkyrie, Valkyrie, Valkyrie Working Dog out of Salem. Uh, Josh Campbell introduced us to Jesse Monroe, the owner and trainer and handler of Rook. And he's the one that's training Brad Evans along with Rook. And uh, Rook is all trained. We just got to get Brad trained to understand what Brad needs to do. The dog knows what, what he needs to do. He needs but anyway, to yeah, he needs to stay, uh, Brad needs to be a sport. Melody, that's a full-time job for her. But anyway, we're going to introduce you and let you, uh, Jesse explain what's going to take place. And then I think in a minute or two, you're going to let Brad work a little, aren't you? Uh, I'm going to work him. Brad needs to, they okay. got to build that rapport up and stuff. And uh, so I'm going to run him on it, and then I'm going to let Brad run him on it too, just to kind of get used to holding leash and everything. Uh, like he was saying, the dog's fully trained. It's going to come on the handler, and they got to take a good two-week bonding period to play and get used to each other. So when we start that transition of training and I go to teach him, Brooke's not looking to me for the answers. He's looking for his new dad. Uh, Brooke is a two-year-old German Shepherd, uh, trained on narcotics, does a little bit of tracking. Uh, I've taken the certification. I've worked him on the road. I'm a deputy sheriff down in Dane County. The first night we worked, we got marijuana out of a truck with a vehicle, so he has for reward experience. Uh, he's a very energetic dog with being just two years old. He's still got a little bit of a trend to do up. Once that comes in, he's going to be a great working dog. Uh, but his energy is what we, we focus on with him trying to find that ball. Like uh, Josh was saying earlier, that that's what they're looking for. They associated that odor with the ball, and they're looking for their toy, basically playing hide and seek. So I'm going to run real quick, and then we'll give him a break, and then we'll have Brad come out and run him too. You ready? Come on. Yep, we'll take that Good boys, huh? Good boy, Rook. Good boy.